true. We have made it to Arequipa. Um, we actually made it here yesterday, but we both in public struggling a little bit with travellers coming. Uh, my boyfriend is much worse than me, um, so he's still in bed. Um, but I'm up now. This is our first full day here in the White City. Um, it's called the White City because most of the buildings are built out of this type of rock, uh, which name I can't remember. That is made from volcano because uh, Arequipa is surrounded by three volcanoes, but it is so misty right now, you can't see a single one of them. Uh, hopefully we will at some point. We came in March, we were told that the blue skies would start coming back again, um, so it's a good time to visit. Like It's quiet, but there's, uh, the weather's not too bad, but the forecast looks like it's going to rain all the time, which is going to be fun. Um, I do have a raincoat, but we were told in Lima the summer had arrived late, so... Maybe the rains arrive late here too. We are up in the mountains. We are 2,300 metres above sea level. We, I don't think we're experiencing any um, altitude sickness yet, but uh, we're going to cook off of this, which is uh, quite a bit higher. So hopefully this will help us to adjust. So now I'm um, just enjoying the bit of sun that we have today. Uh, clouds are coming in. We are for walks this morning when it was sunny. So I will show you that now. Um, it is a pre-inca restaurant serving stone age food, um, so it's a lot of like, meat fried in stone and various other things, which we're going to have alpaca for the first time. I have just seen the small ones outside, looking very cute, um, but when in, when in Peru, you try the Peru, you do what the Peruvians do, so we're going to eat some alpaca. which is a
we were about to go out on an excursion. We were going to go to Colca Canyon, which is the big famous thing around here, but you have to leave at 3 a.m. Um, and we've not been sleeping the best, so we thought that was probably a bad idea. And instead, we're going to Las Salinas, which is salt lakes like salt flats like they have in Bolivia. I've never been to a salt flat so I'm excited to go and see that um, and there are also hot springs um, that we're going to go to as well which is very exciting. We're both feeling a little worse for wear uh, with traveller's illness um, so it'll be interesting but I think we've both got our eye mask so we can hopefully sleep on the bus to begin with um, and feel a bit better later on. Hello so today was a bit of a failure. Um, we got on the bus to go minibus to go on this trip um, and it was like jerking us around it was really uncomfortable and then after about half an hour uh, my boyfriend was like you need to get off this bus <laughs> um, because I was really not well uh, it turns out I had altitude sickness got off the bus came back here and have been resting and taking altitude sickness medication and ibuprofen all day um, and sleeping a lot I feel a lot better now um, all of the stuff online says like just resting is and drinking a lot of water is the most important thing to do um, and I'm hoping that I will just continue to get better because we're going up a bit higher on Wednesday to Cusco, which is higher up. But we are going on the trip tomorrow, um, so hopefully we'll feel well enough to, to manage that. I think we will. Right, round two of attempting to go to Las Salinas, and we, it has been confirmed there will be flamingos as well as llamas, alpacas, and another type of thing that is related to llamas and alpacas. So I'm quite excited for that. Feeling much better this morning, so we should make it. Fingers crossed. Crumbly ones, the hard ones, but that's what it tastes like. There are no flamingos, I don't think. There are some llamery, alpacary things, but they're quite far away. Maybe we'll see more later, but it is still very cool. And I'm glad we got out of the mist, it's nice and sunny here too. Uh, for people to wander in. It's quarter past five now. It's very firmly locked. So we came out in the rain, in the pouring rain, for no apparent reason. Unfortunately, I don't know when it is open, I can't find out. Hola! It is our last morning in Arequipa. We're flying to Cusco today. Arequipa has been interesting. 
it's been different than we were expecting because we haven't done as much as we wanted to because both of us had to spend a whole day lying in bed for different illnesses i had altitude sickness really badly the day before yesterday so we had more rest days than we were expecting but we did book more days in Eric Keeper than people necessarily say you need so um probably it worked out it's a really beautiful city though the uh, center is a unesco world heritage site and it's absolutely gorgeous um and so just walking around there and eating around there was really good too so i will see you in cusco <laughs>